Okay then, Josh. Obviously, you've just come down here to sell sharks. What's it like getting to know your new team? Yeah, you know, start my second week. Uh, I've seen a few faces before, you know, and it's it's good to be a part of a team that I'm, I'm familiar with. Obviously, you're making that transition from rugby league to rugby union. There's a couple of other players in the past who've made that change and made it quite effectively. Not least a fellow Wigan player, Jason Robinson. How do you think you could emulate that coming to sale? You know, it's good, you know, when I was a kid, I, I saw I looked up to and following his footsteps, you know, it, it is a little bit special, you know, because I did grow up watching him and, yeah, you know, if I could be as successful as him, you know, it'd, it'd be, uh, yeah, something that I'm, I'd be proud of. And coming into rugby union, did you have any previous experience of the sport? No, it's, no, I've always been league. So what inspired you to make that change? Uh, I've been lucky enough to win trophies, you know, win silverware with Wigan and play for my country, so... I wanted something different and, and uh, when I had the opportunity to come here, you know, it was an offer that I couldn't turn down. And what's your main hope for what you can do with this opportunity that you have got now you've been given that offer? To be successful, you know, there's not many players who've, who've played for the country, you know, and, and played for the country in the opposite code. So, you know, I want to come here and prove everyone wrong. So you think you can get in that white shirt then? I've, you know, you set your goals high, you know, in any job you want, you want to do what's best for you and I think that's what's right for me. Now, just looking at your amateur club, Wigan St. Patrick's, you've got Owen Farrell, you've got Joel Tompkins, you might have Josh Charnley coming up. What is it about Wigan St. Patrick's making international rugby union players? You know, it's a good amateur club, you know, there's a lot of good coaches there, there's a lot of kids who are, who are passionate about the sport. You know, in Wigan, it's, it's all rugby, you know, there's the football team, but, you know, everyone who's from Wigan will, will know about Wigan St. Pat's. So it's, it's a good club to be at if you're a, an amateur kid, you know, and... You say it has got a, a good feeder team. And finally, the weekend's game against Wasps. How are you feeling about that? You know, if I get the opportunity to play, you know, it'll be uh, something that I'll look forward to. But, you know, you say I've only had four sessions here and I'm still new to, to everything. I'm still learning. I still don't know what I'm doing, but I'll just follow the boys around if I play.